Hello everyone and welcome to Gilbert's Gaming Channel. I'm a dude and we're about to play our Mexico playthrough on Conflict of Nations. Day 26. Beep, 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 beep. Okay, now let's have a look. Oh, yeah, we have ranked up by the way. Um, let's have a look here. I'm just making sure. Open. Hmm. You can do all that you want. I don't know if I'm going to let you in. I'm sorry. Let's check our messages. If we want to team up against WND, yeah, why not? Okay. Cuba. I'm sending boats to South Korea. That's what I said. Oh, yes. Bad. Stay careful. Don't know. What do you mean with Spain? Oh, what do I mean with Spain? I like, go attack Spain. That's what, you know. Have a look. I can't. I can't tell people what to do. I'm not the boss. Uh, sent right away to you. I'm over in the Philippines with boats right now. Right of way will avoid accidental war. Ah, oh, that's a good point. It will actually do that. Um, okay, let's do it. I feel like we're prepared to fight if we need to. Okay. Let's go over and check out where I've put the boats. Here. Now, my plan was to get a little boat and bombard the poop out of that. This little dude is going to come and help. He's... <laughs> How long is that going to take? Yes, do it. That's going to take one day, nine hours. These are going to be there in three hours, nine minutes. So it should be clear by the time that troop gets there. We're just going to we're just going to give it a go. Let's see what happens. Um, right, resources. We're doing all right. I haven't really popped on it much today. I think I did it once. So let's have a look what we can do. Yeah, we changed that to right away. Have we got any research we want? Probably if we upgrade our boats would be a really good time to do that. And yep. And that's used all our rare materials. Mm. As you can see, we're building the four docks. The level four docks, sorry. Um, this is so that we can start getting cruisers. We're going to add them to our navy. It's going to be beautiful. Excellent. I need to start annexing stuff, don't I? Our, our resources are looking good. Um, we could still improve them. I'm sort of like addicted to improving resources. Just want loads. Give me all the resources. Can't even afford it. Ain't got no rare materials, man. Ain't got no rare materials. Okay. Let's build a bunch of dudes. Uh, you've got no... That's it. That's all we can do. Components, man. That's not good. That is not enough. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Well, you know what? We're just going to see what happens with this one troop. And having all those ships sitting next to it will help defend it. I mean, that'll be good. Once we've cleared this one, I'll probably send the ships to go do one, two, three, four, and just start clearing all their homeland, because that will annoy them and probably bring hell upon us. And then these stacks that I've been making, we could start, we could send these over, but I don't want to do it just yet. Let's see what happens first. Their their home defence, if we need them, if we clear it and keep it clear, we'll do so. I think that'd be quite fun. Alright guys, well, I'll leave that one here. We've got nothing else going on. Our allies are... Wow, we've got another one there. Nice. What did that say? Hang on. Look how you gone D. Okay. Right. Sweden lost some land. Uh, potentially. Clever Ocelot. What? 
Okay. We're, we're bomb. Now, are they burned? Oh, they've got Germany with them. Oh, so that's alright. They're friends. Right, cool. Yeah, alright, we'll leave that one here, guys. I'll see you on day 27. Hello all and welcome to day 28 of our Mexico playthrough on Conflict of Nations. Alright, as you can see there's a lot of lines. We're going over towards Japan and South Korea. We've got extra troops going today. They're flying over as far as they can go. Lovely jubbly. Okie dokie. Now we've been talking to Sweden a little bit. And... You've got Sweden and Iraq and Mozambique, and they're all trying to sort of get us on side. He's saying I can trust him, but I still, like I said, I don't trust everyone completely, unless I know them. Uh, we don't know what's going to happen, but as you can see, we've bombarded the heck out of Japan. We're going to be capturing this real soon. Our troops are going to land. We lost those destroyers over here. I think they got destroyed by the um, the striker jet they've had going in and out the whole time. So as soon as we're done with Japan, our boats will go and lay claim to all the harbours across South Korea. So what have we got? One, two, three, four, five. And then another one on the way. One, two, three, four, five, six. We can just go take all of these in quick succession. We'll send in as many troops as we can to claim it as fast as we can. Talking of troops, let's go have a look what we can build and get that going. We've got free infantry going now. I'm just going to make a bunch more infantry just to make sure we've got troops capable of claiming territory. Beautiful. That'll do. Now, we might be annexing. Are we annexing somewhere? Nope. Not yet. Hmm. Let's upgrade. We need an arms industry level one there. Can we upgrade any further? No. Okay. Well, we can get some more rare materials in. Keep up. We've got to stay on top of our technology just to make sure we're at the top of the game. We're in a position of power and we need to keep that. You know, we've got to keep an eye out for Sweden making any naughty advances on us. And um, as you can see, our allies are coming in to help over here as well. That's good. Lovely jubbly. We're going to make short work of this. But anyway, I'll leave that one here and we'll be back for day 29. Hey all and welcome to day 29 of our Mexico playthrough on Conflict of Nations. Right, let's have a look at what has been going on since our last episode yesterday. Hello. Alright, we've got a whole bunch of Peru and Cuba coming over with us. Very nice. And our troops have landed. Are you... Why are you waiting? That's weird, isn't it? Take it. Well, why is that not taken? We've got infantry there. <gasps> no, there's no infantry. Well, that's terrible. Oh well, we've cleared it. Um, I don't know what happened to the infantry. South Korea have brought a boat in. Sixteen. <laughs> that noise. That is terrible. Okay. They got three boats against my little one there. That's not good. Uh, so what we'll do... Club together some boats. they got is that a cruiser oh my god five cruisers wow that boat is dead and it's in range 
Wow. That is really cool. Okay, let's split off. And go and clear up some more of this. Let's go across here. While we know it's empty, we can get there quite quickly. Are oh, they sending in strike fighter? Fighter squadron. Okay. No worries. I'm sure we'll be able to tackle that. Although it looks like they're patrolling, so they're just keeping an eye on what we do at the moment. What is that? Oh no, that's just a ring. Is it a ring? What is that? The heck is, is that a missile? Oh my days, I have no idea. Don't use missiles. No point. Too much damage. Right, Iraq. Last call. Korea is very experienced and you may cross Pacific soon and make you a lot of problems. I can stop here if you join our efforts to fight Sweden. And Korea won't last long. There you go. About to have just have fun with it. Yeah. I mean, I've been getting on with Sweden since the start, so they're all trying to talk me out of uh, being friends with Sweden. But at the end of the day, we all got to fight someone eventually, right? We're going to actually keep a look, keep an eye on Sweden. To make sure they're not doing enough annoy in our land. Every now and then we need just to have a look. We've surrounded their port and where they can spawn from. So um, I don't see an issue. Just keep an eye out for any troops that might well land. Lovely. We've got a fair few resources here. So um, first things first guys. Air base. Let's build an airbase. We're going to take Japan over very quickly and make them pay. Increase my destroyers. I've got a few of them we need to keep alive. And right, let's look at troops. We've got troops coming. We need more. Can we get a tank as well just to increase our survivability? Very nice. Industry, we should be pretty alright. It's going quite well. Let's level that one up to five. Now we're too poor. Okay. Okay. Looking good. Once Peru and Cuba land, it's game over. I don't know what they're firing. That is a concern. Why do we need to fire missiles at Japan when I'm under control? Hmm. I'll keep an eye on that. But anyway, we're probably going to lose this destroyer. They seem... What are they attacking, exactly? Attacking Tokyo. Oh well, we'll see what happens. We'll get our other boats around there. We'll make a bit of a stack and we're going to start hitting them. Making sure their boats don't come in and take over. And then uh, we'll get round to their homeland cities as fast as possible and start destroying their morale. We're going to make a, a big heavy land grab once we hit there. Probably going to attack South Korea all over. Probably Russia at the same time, leaving no one behind us. And then we'll see about the Philippines because we know that um, Sweden has been attacking the Philippines. However, has he? I don't see no smoke. And I know he's not taking any of the land. Why would you not take the land? I'm not sure. So that's why I'm keeping an eye on Sweden just in case he is setting us up to fail. But we'll keep an eye on that. Alright guys, well I'll leave that one here. We'll be back tomorrow with day 30. Thank you very much. See you there. 
Hey all and welcome to day 30 for our Mexico playthrough on Conflict of Nations. Alright, let's have a look at what's been going on and where we're at with pushing on Japan. Just make sure there's nothing coming in that shouldn't be coming in, you know. Checking our uh, friends. Nice. As you can see we've got more troops heading out. So they're making their way over to Japan. We have all our boats come around so they've been destroying some bits and pieces. Anytime they get a boat, we're going to take it out. Looks like they're building their boats from there. So let's move that one around here. We've already cleared Seal. Seoul. And um, yeah, we'll clear this one out and destroy the, the harbor if we have to. Beautiful. All right, these guys are going to disembark and capture the city. We'll move around, take that island. It's going to be lovely. Cuba's moved in and taken a few... Japanese cities, but that's alright. We don't need to have them all. It's just would have been nice, you know. Um, what we got? I'll tell you what, we could. Let's take the infantry out. Go tidy up this island rather than sitting around doing nothing. So that'll be that one done. Lovely. Ah, go away. No gold. No gold. Uh, we could do the same with this. The tank should be able to take care of whatever pop up, if it should pop up. All right, let's move these infantry out and about. Back there. We got some more guys landing here yet. Yeah. No, that's all Cuba. Okay. Still don't know what this red line is. What, is it a bomb? I don't know. Right, just go and take one piece of land at a time, and then go back. Lovely. Lovely, jubbly. Right, we'll fully take Japan. We've got more troops coming in anyway. And as soon as that's done, we'll be moving straight in for their home territories. As you can see, Peru's got a couple of carriers. That's pretty cool. I like that. Let's have a look at what our friends have to say. Um, oh, thanks. It costs ten and 5000 You don't have to give me 5000 I assume that means. Okay. Um, there we go. So this is this is Cuba. We'll give him the 5000 Boom. Was that? Was that today? Well, I wrote a lot of uh, day twenty nine. So this was yesterday. Um. Let him know. Done them all. Love me. Love me. Um, yeah. So we just need to go back here and then see what we're doing over here. Lots of things happening. Fights, bombings, a lot. Excellent. Can we build anything? Mexico City doesn't have a thing to... Interesting. We could build... We can get some of these attack helicopters. I kind of want to do that. Yeah. Yeah, let's do that. Build it. Build it. And what about this one? Do the same here? No. Because it's level one. No. Can't even afford to upgrade it. No. Damn. Can we afford anything? Was there anything? No. Damn, damn, damn. Okay. It's okay. Get more infantry for taking land. Now, is there anything we can upgrade? Is there anything without a level one? That one. This one. Everything that's building airports. All right. Can't even afford level one. That's disgusting. Okay. 
Well, I guess we'll just wait and see what happens then. We'll get our troops over there. Mm, if I can... Tell them where to go, that would be nice. Might even just go straight on here. One day, 11 hours. Go on, just do it. Just do it, see what happens. We've got some helicopters and stuff, and that's for defending our lands. And we're just going to keep pushing with the infantry tanks and um, boats. Alright guys, well, I'll leave that one here. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you are enjoying it. If you are, please do drop a like on the video and subscribe to the channel for more daily content. And I'll see you on day 31. The dude is out.